Hey Cubs, what is going on? Chocolate Bear here, and um, as you can see, we're back in the wonderful realm of Skyrim. Um, yeah, I with the last series, I kind of got a bit carried away, went away and actually just played it through, because in some ways I just didn't want to sit down and talk. That's a bit of a weird um, Yeah, I, I didn't want to just sit down and talk over the top of the game I was trying to enjoy. Hmm, oh. strange. Um, yeah, I didn't want to just sort of like ruin the game for myself, really. I wanted to play it through and enjoy it. So, uh, I'm back now, and I'm just going to sort of carry on. I've gotten to the point where I was. Admittedly, I'm now a woman, <laughs> which is a big change. Uh, and I'm going for swords, which isn't equipped, but I'm going for swords this time, instead of um, bow and arrow, which is what I did when I actually did my full character, leveled him up to the top, you know, sort of had all the perfect stats, um, could stealth kill someone from a mile away, could take down dragons with arrows, uh, finished all the mage guild, fighters guild, well not fighters guild, the um, the one that's in here, I can't remember what it's called now, um, god that's some bright floor, yeah as you can see I put an ENB um, graphics enhanced around here um, and several other things like sort of lots of the mods on Skyrim um, like a God, drop of the frame rate like a blur whenever you look at something uh, sometimes works in our favour sometimes it doesn't like sometimes I'll have my swords out and it'll be just looking at the swords and everything else will blur and obviously you don't want that because um, yeah, you get screwed uh, new vivid wildlife and great new water system put them in so yeah uh, that's the sort of upgrades I mean yeah if you want a list of the upgrades I can write one out and put it in the description but just uh, put it in the comments that you want to see one and I shall get right on that um, I haven't done much to sort of change the game oh that's, that's a bit strange he wasn't dead last time I was here um, must have happened recently. Oh well. Got something to say? Why are you still following me? Get go away. Um. Hmm. Well, he's look at him follow me. He's not doing anything. He's not, he's not a bad guy. So yeah, just taking out the dragon and uh, let's go see what the Jarl has to say. Um. I should try and enjoy the storyline as You're much as possible. Here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? I knew I could count on Irileth, but there must be more to it than that. You don't say. Um, I absorbed some kind so of power. True. It feels tingly. Beards really were summoning you. Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. Look at them shadows. Really, really good quality Dragon stuff now. Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to folk. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. Well, thank you. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The oh. Greybeards. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Yes, Wi-Fi? I did. That was the voice of the Greybeard. Do I have to carry on listening to you? you or? By my right is oh, there we go. I name you Thane of White Rock. Aha! Let's go get Lydia! Lydia! I assign you Lydia as a personal house car. And this weapon for She's gonna die so quickly. I'll also notify my guards of your new... Alright, shut up. We are honored to have you as Thane of our city. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with... Lydia! Lydia, come here! The Jarl has appointed me to be your house car. Follow me. Lead the way. I haven't got the mod that takes out the sass. I'm I'm sworn to carry your burdens. I haven't got that mod. I decided I think it would ruin the game if she wasn't all sassy. God, White Run looks fantastic there. This new EMB, EMB and all sorts of texture packs and water texture packs and all sorts of stuff really do make it a stunning game. Um, especially when, I mean, I'm getting about 40 frames per second right now. So, 
and hardly any drops. Like the drops go down to like 36, but there's you know they're not noticeable. Um, I mean, it might change when we get into some combat. I'm not sure. We'll have to see. Um, but who knows? Kid running. Take it out with a sword. Can't be bothered to start. I'm not going to... Uh, the plan with this is I'm not going to do any... Oh, bloody hell. We're looking for someone in Go white. away. And we'll pay good a woman. She is likely not using Goodbye. Her yeah, I'm not going to do any of the side quests. I'm just going to do... What I'm going to do is I'm going to do a straightforward playthrough. And then... Uh, you know, I might do like a set of videos on the Dark Brotherhood and a set of videos on, you know, the Mages Guild. Slowly leveling my character up. Can't be bothered to go around the long way. Um, all right, where do I need to go? Top of the mountain, and that requires me to go to Ivarstead. Now, in the old game, I wandered. Yeah, I actually walked all the way there. Oh yeah, horse armor. Looks pretty awesome. Yeah, I walked all the way there. I'm hoping this guy. Can take me there. I can take you to any of the hold. Where do you want to go? Um, damn it! All right. Well, what's near to there? I ain't walking all the way around. Oh no, actually no. It's probably just, it's about equal distance to walk. I'll walk it then. Until then there's some time. bandits to kill on the way, so it's always a bit fun. And it's beautiful countryside to walk through. Look at that water. Um, but yeah, I think this is a it's a nice little break from uh, Dead Space, which I'm not gonna lie has been uh, giving me heart attacks. Ooh, nah, no, shit. Let's go with these two. Ah ha ha! Two swords, bitches. Where's Lydia? Lydia and my random person following along. Um, yeah, it's different with this one because obviously there's not. Because nothing's going to jump out and scare the crap out of me. I'm trying to find things to say in the middle. Um, I'm not even going to bother to talk about the football. I did just watch it. Italy versus England. But <laughs> I don't know enough. That if any of you actually ask any questions, I'm going to sit there and go. Um, I kicked the ball. You know, that, that's probably about it for my football knowledge. Very, you know, very good game. I liked it. I'm glad that I've been joking all day that it was going to go to penalties. Um, like in the sort of sense I hope to because I mean I like penalties that make a game interesting but and tense but it obviously went to penalties and that wasn't in the long run the best thing for us who are these two are they going to attack me no the dog looks friendly my assumption is she is also friendly oh it's a hunter fair enough then don't need to be talking to her Keep on wondering. Hmm. Yeah, that's the problem with this game. Until you've got enough money to buy a horse, or you get um, Shadow Mare from. I think it's Shadow. Yeah. Oh, God. Lovely blood, blood splatters. Yeah, as I was saying, until you sort of get the um, the money to buy a horse or Shadow Mare, it's just not. It just takes forever to get to places. Um, but then, in some ways, that's the fun of the journey. You know, you find little spots, little bits and pieces. You know, like you could wander off up that way, but you'd eventually reach a bit where you can't go any further upwards. So there's probably something up there, but not like what I want to do. Um, that's where the advantage of having played this already comes in that, you know, I've uh, explored the land. I, I know what everything does. Um, as you can see, I've turned off the sort of view distance, things slowly come in. Uh, and it's just so that we can record for a little bit better. And the here and now looks a lot nicer. Um, let's go and clear out this fort. Could, should I do it stealthily? Don't know if I can be bothered. Because you can sort of take a couple of pot shots with the arrows, like especially people on the bridge. Knock them into the water, and then they're gone. You know that you don't. But then the person they're still gonna ask me for a toll and still attack me, so I'm just gonna i I'm just gonna walk up to the gate and kill them. There they are, or oh, there she is. Hello. This here's a toll road, see? You're gonna have to hand over, say, two hundred gold if you want Fuck to. Fuck off. I don't even think I have two hundred gold. Huh. Never 
And she's down. How quick was that? And now we wait, because they're, they're all going to come. Or not. I guess they are archers. Yeah, there's a couple of, couple of archers. Yes, I uh, have got a bit of a cheat on there with the lockpick pro. I think I may have just unlocked, oh no, unlocked the trap, but not the case. Yeah, I have got a little bit cheat, but that's only because it just speeds up the game and I can actually get on with things. Because generally, in most cases, you only get like a couple of coins, bits and pieces, nothing. I'm going to go up there, get this one. Oh, dropping some frames, sorry about that. Off the edge with you. Oh, oh, it's such a pity that it's dropping loads of frames right now. Because that was beautiful. How are my people doing? Eh, oh, they're running through. This is a good thing when you have like two or three people following you. Oh god, the frame rate drop is horrible. Um, this is what you get for running it with hundreds of mods. I mean, it might not be... I think the frame rate drop will be on the video, but... But um, sometimes, you know, you can play it through and you'll, you'll get loads of frame rate drop, but the actual video doesn't. Oh, God. Alright, I may have to cut the recording short on this one whilst I uh, go and turn down some of the stuff on my computer. Because, uh, obviously, you know, there, there will be performance. Go off the bridge. Oh, there's already one down there. Um, yeah, there will be performance drops, like other, other programs using most of the computer. Uh, potion, don't need a pickaxe. Just collecting their bits and pieces because it'll better equip me to... F oh, bloody hell, I'm still carrying dragon bones. Oh, well, there's a shop in... I think there's a shop in the place I'm going. Take that. I'll take that. That. that that's uh, the one tip I would give. Um, would be pick up little ingredients and eat them because they give you alchemy boosts and uh, it's just extra extra sort of like XP towards getting getting those uh, extra levels uh, same Let's just quickly ingredients blah, blah, blah. there we go alright let's get back to the other side and then uh, I shall stop the recording and go and um, go and see what's up with it. See what's up with my computer. See what I can shut down. Blah 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 blah. There we go. See, nice and cleared. Nice and easy. See, it's now cleared up. Now there's no enemies. But see, that will be a problem because I know there will be enemies later on. Let's have a look over this waterfall. Ah, beautiful, beautiful Skyrim. All right. Um, yeah. So, cheers for watching. Hope uh, hope you enjoy the comeback to Skyrim, and uh, I'll catch you once I've sorted out performance. Peace out, Cubs.